There are 28 students whose last name begins with the letters G, H, or J, or K. Information about the probability of randomly selecting one of these students is listed below. Okay, so basically um, there's a bunch of people. I select of them, a bunch of them. Uh, 28 of them have like Gonzalez or Hernandez or Jones or Katz with a K. The probability of selecting a student whose last name begins with G is one out of seven. What does that mean? All right, well, if there's 28 students uh, that fall under this category and one out of seven is a G, one seventh times 28 means four kids have the last name that start with a G. All right. Uh, probability of selecting a student whose last name begins with a G or an H, uh, if, okay, is five over 14. So if it's five over 14 and there's 28 students, that means 10 of them have a G or an H. How did I do that in my head without having to think fractions? Well, 14 is half of 28. So if you were to double 14, you'd have to double five too. So 10 have the last name of G or H. The question here is how many of these students have a last name that begins with H? Well, if it's G or H and there's 10 of them, but four of them have a last name that start with G, let's, <laughs> let's get rid of that four. Let's just pretend I did that on purpose. Six people have a last name that starts with an H. The answer is C, Dunzo.